Residents tell 10 News they're tired of people littering, urinating, even having sex near their yards. They say it's the patrons from a nearby bar. Covering the South Bay, 10 News reporter Joe Little reveals why police aren't blaming the bar. So this is my backyard. Carmen Kiros has only lived here a year. It leads to um, East Park Lane. But she's already annoyed with the folks who spill out of this Chula Vista bar. That's why Willie's right in the corner. Kiros says she faces some kind of problem every night. We find used condoms in our backyards. We find empty alcohol bottles. We caught them doing having sex on the grass. Neighbor Audrey Hall says the problem has gotten progressively worse. I've even stood out in my yard and hollered at him. Chula Vista Police Captain Gary Wedge has heard the complaints. He says police have met with neighbors and Wild Woolies owner. It resulted in new lights along this road. The bar owner even agreed to take extra steps to make sure her patrons go home instead of hanging around here. The, the bar owner has been uh, incredibly receptive. Uh, everything we have asked of her, she has done. Wedge also says police regularly patrol the area. This is what we wake up every single morning to. But neighbors aren't satisfied. We're in a residence residential area and we shouldn't have to put up with this. People are still unhappy. If people are still unhappy, our job is to do what we can to address those concerns. I spoke to the bar's owner on the phone. She says she's willing to do whatever it takes to make sure Wild Woolies is a better neighbor. Every night there's literally a party going on. In Chula Vista, Joe Little, 10 News. Chula Vista police say they've responded to Wild Woolies about 100 times last year. Half of those calls were during a regular patrol of the area.